How to stay on track for a tight schedule is probably the second most popular question I'm asked by clients. And this is one that's actually in your control more than you think. When setting a realistic timeline, what you'll want to do is make sure that you're considering effort as well as duration. So a few days of effort may take me a couple of weeks if I have other responsibilities or other projects on the go. It's very important, therefore, to keep things on track that if you have people who are pivotal in making decisions on the project, that they be available for a good chunk of time every day to go through the communications that are so important to keep things moving forward. A couple of great tools for keeping on track are having daily check-in meetings, scrum meetings, some people call them, where you talk about what you did the day before, what you're going to do today, and any blockers that come up. Another good way to make sure your time is being used effectively is to make SMART goals. SMART goals are specific, measurable, achievable, realistic, and time-bound. As the project progresses, you may find things are starting to slow down a little. What you can do to make sure that you stay on track is to have weekly breakdowns of the goals that you have for the week, daily meetings, and a list of any roadblocks or important decisions that come up. If you're in a time crunch and you want to move even faster, there's three things that you can do. You can add more resources, which always runs the risk of having a too many cooks in the kitchen kind of situation. Or you can assign one person just to take care of roadblocks, making sure that everybody has what they need when they need it. Lastly, if those two don't work, it's time to simplify features. Sometimes towards the end of a project, there's a lot of late thrashing. It's a bit like trying to get your little kid to finally go to sleep. Extra night light, extra blanket, glass of water, door open, door closed. Sometimes you just need to draw a line and say, that's it, go to bed, we're launching the project. For more on hitting your timeline, read the blog post below.